Hey guys, what's up, Fluffy? And I'm. Oh god, no. I'm here today playing Five Nights at Freddy's 1. And oh god, I regret everything right now. So I may. I told someone while I was over at Fuzzy's that I would record and play through every single Five Nights at Freddy's game. All the way through this time, because last time I have chickened out and I didn't finish it. Well, I'm beginning to regret that decision already because I've completely forgotten how creepy the first one is. Um, so we're just gonna roll on in into all in and in and in and in and in and in and all into it, and we're gonna see how this goes because oh god, guys, do I hate jump scares. They are the bane of the fluffy existence. They're like, they're like a, they're a, oh god. <sighs> Honestly though, the only, or the most ideal way to win the first night, in my opinion, is just to close the left door and do absolutely nothing. Because it is so extremely rare that, uh, what's his name, Foxy comes out on night one that, Shut up, uh, Freddy! Oops, I clicked something. I apologize. I'm here to tell you, there's nothing to worry about. I didn't think that freaking so Freddy sang all that. Let's just focus on getting you through your first. Okay. Uh, let's see. First, there's an introductory greeting from the company that I'm supposed to read. It's kind of a legal thing, you know. Um, welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, a magical place for kids and grown-ups alike, where fantasy and fun come Hi, to life. Freddy. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for damage to property or a person. Upon discovering that damage or death have occurred, a missing person report will be filed within 90 days or as soon as property and premises have been thoroughly cleaned and bleached and the carpets have been replaced. Blah, blah, blah. Kind of now that might sound bad, I know, but there's really nothing to worry about. No, there's nothing uh, to worry about. The are characters you here do get a bit quirky at night, but do I blame them? No. If I were forced to sing those same stupid songs for 20 years and I never got a bath, I'd probably be a bit irritable at night too. So remember, these characters hold a special place in the hearts of children and we need to show them a little respect. Right? Okay. So just be aware, the characters do tend to wander a bit. Uh, they're left in some kind of free roaming mode at night. Uh, something about their servos locking up if they get turned off for too long. Uh, they used to be allowed to walk around during the day too, but then there was the bite of 87. Yeah, it's amazing that the human body can live without the frontal lobe, you know? Uh, now concerning your safety, the only real risk to you as a night watchman, if any, is the fact that these characters, uh, if they happen to see you after hours, probably won't recognize you as a person. They'll, they'll most likely see you as a metal endoskeleton without its costume on. Now, since that's against the rules here at Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, They'll probably try to forcefully stuff you inside a Freddy Fazbear suit. Um, now that wouldn't be so bad if the suits themselves weren't filled with cross beams, wired, and animatronic devices, especially around the facial area. So you can imagine how having your head forcefully pressed inside one of those could cause a bit of discomfort and death. And uh, the only part that you would like to see the line of day again would be your eyeballs and teeth pop out the front of the mask here. Yeah, they don't tell you these things when you sign up. But hey, first day sleep breeze. I'll chat with you tomorrow. Uh, check those cameras and remember to close the doors only if absolutely necessary. Gotta conserve power. Alright, good night. What kind of place has so little power that it, er, are so, is so cheap that it has a limited amount of power. Like, it kids play in this place. I mean, I don't, I'm, okay, I'm 17. I can still be classified as a child, in a way. I mean, just look at these things. These things would give me nightmares. I'd be walking around, freaking playing around, 
I see those things up on the stage. I'd be like, what's going on? Mom, what is that? Help me. I'd be like freaking the crud out. And kids and like. And in the storyline, the kids love this place. Like. Stop playing the tour of March or. Chica has moved. Hi, Chica. Uh -oh, uh -oh.
I'll do it later. Do I leave this in a separate video? <sighs> All right. You know what? We're gonna we're gonna cut it there for now. And I am going to say thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Am na am na am na. I hope you enjoyed the video. Of course, night one was boring, so I'll probably upload night two as well today, just because night one is boring. But I don't want to make them into two, two in one videos. So on that note, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.